Welcome back. I'm Tara. And I'm Grace. And you're watching the Canine Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> so, Grace, I have got to share with you one of my guilty pleasures that I had today. What was that? I had three pieces of Mardi Gras King Cake. Three. Three pieces. Okay. I know. I should probably sell it out. Okay. <laughs> okay. So speaking of holidays, today we're going to talk about how to utilize holidays for your Facebook content to increase fan engagement. Ooh, let's start with a holiday that has candy. Mm, like Valentine's Day? Exactly. All right. So a good way to promote Valentine's Day is by highlighting your staff. So for example, you can share a photo of your staff and share why they love working um, with their company. Um, one of the main benefits of doing this for your business is because it shows um, employer morale and it also benefits social media by increasing fan engagement. And that's like kind of like your likes, comments and shares. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Mm hmm. Um, I can think of another way to promote Valentine's Day. Um, so promote a service. Um, it benefits your business by increasing customer loyalty and sales mm -hmm. and also promotes lead generation and engagement on social media. Another uh, holiday that I really actually truly do enjoy is Easter. Number one, because it's springtime and springtime is just full of freshness and, you know, good vibes. So obviously Easter falls into that. One way that you can promote Easter within your business is to host an online event like a virtual Easter egg hunt. Um, you can do this by taking pictures around your office um, and literally buying Easter eggs and uh, putting them in little spots around the photo and put, posting that on Facebook and asking your uh, fans to see if they find the Easter egg in the photo. I like that. Thank That's you. really creative. Thank I really you. like that. Um, another way that I can think of to promote Easter on Facebook would be to uh, create a contest. Mm -hmm. So you can get like a large container, buy some plastic Easter eggs, or maybe reuse the Easter eggs that you might have hid for um, another piece of content if you already did one. Mm -hmm. And then um, fill that container with those Easter eggs. And then you ask your followers to share that post and to also comment how many Easter eggs they think are inside of that container. And then whoever submits the closest guess gets a prize. That's pretty smart. Boom, off the top of my head. <laughs> <laughs> All right, to the next. Now let's talk Halloween. So for Halloween, my suggestion is that you focus on promoting your services or your products. So for example, you can have a staff member dress up in spooky attire or something a little bit more adorable <laughs> <laughs> and have them uh, talk about a specific product or a service uh, on camera and post it as a video. So uh, in return, you can get more sales because people are a little bit more interested to stop and actually watch what's going on on camera because you're all dressed up, mm -hmm. uh, promote brand awareness and it'll also benefit your company culture the one of the things that you can also do for halloween is just the classic group photo nothing ever beats anything that has to do with boosting employee morale and it also just boost um company culture and obviously increases engagement with your followers as well True. so um, taking individual um, costume photos as well as group as well as just chilling. Let's say you're at your desk and then someone just takes a standby photo of you. That's would be great as well. Right. I mean, could you imagine a tiger typing on a laptop? Just typing I couldn't. away. Just typing away. Yeah. Doing the business. But yeah. hey, I mean, that's our Working list for today, nine folks. Nine to five. Could you imagine? <laughs> She's doing it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways. That's our list for today, folks. We really hope you enjoyed all the content here and all the hidden gems that we <laughs> dropped on for you. <laughs> um, why don't you leave down in the comments below what your favorite holiday is and how you would market for them based on what you have heard here today. See you next time. Bye. Bye.